Hey, so here is Flirtini app. Let's do a quick overview how it works. So first of all, you just create an account here with uh, Snapchat or Apple ID or Google, and then you just enter a few questions, super quick actually, so there aren't like some difficult or, or something like that. So super quick, and then it's just like a dating app. So you swipe up to like, swipe down to not like. So for example, this is how it looks like. Then you can just see the photos. Then you can just try to message. Uh, let's see how it works. You can do that. You can report a block. Uh, you have two attempts to start a new chat today. Um, then you have your profile and top left. Uh, you can change your pictures. You can, of course, add photos, your location, about me, add your like all self summary and all of that. And then just go to the gear icon. Here's your account status. So uh, if you want to upgrade, it is possible to upgrade here. So you can view all incoming likes, like see every new like, chat with any user you want, access all top stories, additional search filters, enjoy communication, like medium messages. And then let's see how expensive is that. So for seven days is ten dollars. You can get one year for fifty nine and three months for forty nine. So that's that. Of course, if you want to cancel it later, you will need to um, go through the App Store. If you want to watch the tutorial, you can hear the watch the tutorial. Um, yeah, uh, in the bottom, if you want, you can also tap forget your data. Uh, so also, if you want to cancel your account, just tap delete account here in the bottom in the account status menu. So that's that. And then of course you can use filters. So same as in Tinder, if you want to enable extra filters, you will need to upgrade. Then you have your likes, visitors, history, and all of that. Then you have stories. You can get the stories here. Hey, 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 hey. So something like that. And then you can just post it. And if you post more stories, you will have more chance to be discovered and liked and all of that. So that's the idea here. Basically, that's the app. That's how it looks like. It's in the top charts, actually, in the US App Store. So it's interesting. It has really nice design, very easy to use. And if you're just tired of Tinder or Bumble or, uh, I don't know, some other dating, popular dating apps, you can give a try to this app. It has a really nice uh, minimalistic design and it just feels nice. So that's the app. So that's just a quick preview for you. Hope that was helpful. If you have any additional questions, then just leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.